Varial Flip Skate Support. Thanks a lot for sending in your video. I really liked it. So to start off with your kickflip, looks like your toe is barely on the board and you just flip the board and it looks like you could work a little bit more on just getting your kickflip a little more solid as well as your pop shove it as well because when you land it looks a little bit sketchy just for doing those tricks separately it's fine but it looks to me like you should get a little more comfortable with both the kickflip and the pop shove it before you move on to the varial kickflip so when you do the varial flip most of the time you're landing with the board upside down so the board is just not spinning enough you actually come pretty close in that you do land on top of the board, so you are committing, which is good, but you just have to get that extra rotation down on the actual kickflip part. So when I slow down your video, you do the pop shove it, and then you just barely hit it with the toe of your front foot. And what this causes is your board to just barely flip. Now one thing that I notice is that your front foot is barely on the board, just a very small part of your toe is on there which is fine and which appears to work all right for you on your kick flips but when you add that in with the pop shove it to do the varial flip it's not quite cutting it so for that I suggest putting your toe more onto the board so yeah this is the series of tricks it looks like you got the kick flip and the pop shove it pretty down but like I said it could do you good to just make sure you master those tricks fully before you try to put them both together in the varial flip now look at my foot position Look at my front foot and how much of it is on the board. It's a lot more than just my toe. And it's true that having your toe more off the side of the board will help it spin a little faster. And the, having your foot more on the board will cause a slower spin. But in your case, you're popping the board away from you with your back foot, and then your toe doesn't even catch the front of the board to cause the actual spin rotation of the kick foot. So I hope that makes sense because it's like you're shoving the board away before your toe can get it scraped off to actually cause a spin. So watch this. Watch my front foot, my toe. It really scoops off of the edge there and causes it to spin the kickflip rotation. So for any of you guys learning any of the basics of skateboarding, it's really, really, really important to have the basics down. And videos like this is the exact reason why because when you progress up into the harder tricks, all the harder tricks are putting the basics together. Frontside flip is a 180 and a kickflip. So check out Skateboarding Made Simple, you won't be disappointed.